With two weeks to go before Election Day, the president spoke here at the Democratic headquarters looking to shore up support so New Hampshire doesn't go red. Fired up. Listen to what they say. They mean it. They mean it. And pleading please. with voters. Please, please, please. We count your votes earlier than everybody else. President Joe Biden making a stop in Concord just two weeks before Election Day. New Hampshire is a beacon, not a joke. You're a beacon. You guys do it, it'll, make a, it'll send a message that's profound. The president thanking Democratic loyalists, yeah. urging them to make sure the Granite Where State the goes blue as he went after we former President right Trump. We gotta lock him up. <laughs> Politically lock him up. Attacking him in a policy speech earlier in the afternoon, too. He wants to replace the Affordable Care Act with he calls, this is what he refers to, a concept of a plan. I've heard that concept of a plan now for almost eight years. A concept of a plan. What the hell is a concept of a plan? He has no concept of anything. Biden teed up by Senator Bernie Sanders, touted his administration's work to cut prescription drug costs for Americans. When we had, when we got elected, we were told we'd never get anything done. We had a one vote majority. And anyway, we'd never get anything big done. We got a hell of a lot big done. The visit was a last hurrah of sorts, likely his last time in the Grand State as president. <laughs> Those cheers of gratitude echoed throughout the afternoon. This was part of my saying, thank you, Joe, for what you have done for us. In Concord, Ariel Metropolis, WMUR News 9.